Good morning, my friends, and welcome back to the show. Appreciate y'all tuning in today. It is a brisk fall morning, and we are doing some bass fishing. That's right, folks. I'm on Lake Thanota Sassa, out on my father-in-law's boat. And yeah, um, I'm not the greatest bass fisherman ever, so if you guys want to see me epically fail, stay tuned. But I'll also link a uh, video below that uh, my last trip out bass fishing on this boat. So anyway, we're going to get started. It's got a, we got a beautiful morning. Um, wind's going to be... Uh, maybe a little bit of a challenge today probably not too bad 10 to 15 maybe if it as it picks up and uh, just a beautiful morning check this out y'all so let's go get after them All right, just so I can see where I'm at, you got you got a bait caster with a, a worm or a soft plastic on, or something that might be just easy to cast. There we go. You want? Have you ever thrown one at all? I have, but it's been more of a um, it's been more of a conventional size, like a, a bigger size. Um, I'll tighten it down pretty good. I mean, I know the concept, but I'm, I'm definitely open to input on right. how to. I tighten it down pretty good. It, the only thing is, you don't rather than flipping it like you do the other ones you just kind of more of an easy yeah you just kind of like you're trying to talk mud, mud off a stick all right I, that's pretty tight i can almost cast that one without putting your thumb on the yeah, yeah if i don't cast it hard okay so yeah you may need to loosen it up or tighten it okay whatever you need to do and if you get a bird this no big deal all I, right we can get them out thank you i've gotten out the worst Right. If uh, they start biting good, we get your good rod back out. Man, it up a little bit. Okay. All righty, my friends. I'm learning to throw a bait caster, so don't laugh too much at me. But uh, this is the way you bass fish, so this is what I got to do. That wasn't terrible. I might actually even get a bite. Get your thumbnail. Go like that. Oh dang! Right out. Now, even on a, now a great big one, you have to do that. You have to, you have to go like that several times. Okay. Do it and then do it and do it. But it reverses. It reverses all the all the uh, loops and. and uh, It'll come out. That's a good trick right there. Well, that one wasn't even a bad one. But on the real bad one, you can still do it. You just have to, you just have to do your thumb more often. All right. On the bad one. Makes sense. I loosened up just a hair to see if I can get a little more distance. Did not loosen up much at all. Yep. There's one. There's our first fish. I knew we were going to get one here. That's not a bad one either. That's not a bad one. No, he's not bad. Guess on the board. <laughs> sure does look pretty in that sunrise. All right, we're on the board. A pound, pound and a quarter, maybe. Yep. Get us started. <clears throat> the old thumbnail trick there. When you learn from the best, it's easy to do these things. I just had the old thumbnail trick. Did it work? Yeah, it worked. Oh, yeah, it will. It will work. Sometimes you have to do it, you know, three, four, five times if it's a great big one. Yep. So you just keep doing it. Yes, sir. You see that cast? Perfect. Skipped it right under that dock. Didn't get me nothing, but. Yeah, this looks juicy back here. You guys, I'm learning. That was a pretty good bait caster cast right there. If we get a fish, it'd be even better. Perfect. Come on, baby. I don't know what it is. 
Oh my gosh. You want the net? Bring him to you. Okay. Watch that rod. Okay. I'll bring him to you. you ready? Yep. There he is. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my, that is a nice one. He'd go four, probably. I think he goes five. Yeah. You got we got scale though, don't we? Yeah. Careful. Oh, yeah. I got pliers right here if you need them. Too much to drift out of the Here. They're attached to me, so you can pull them, but I don't know if you got enough reach or not. Yeah, I got some. Okay, cool. That's a beauty. <laughs> That's what we're doing here. Heck yeah. That's a beauty, man. You think he goes four? We're going to see. All right. We'll see. Well, uh, four two. That's a beauty, man. Four two. All right. On the rattle trap. On the rattle. Beautiful, trap. man. Absolutely <laughs> gorgeous. See ya. There he goes. Let's see if I can thread the needle here. Look at that. Perfect. There we go. There's a good one. All right. Not not a big one, but a good one. Uh, no, I don't think we need it. Yeah. He's he's shrinking a little. Yeah. <laughs> right, That's right. There he nice. is, folks. There he is. Good job. Not a giant, but we will take it, man. Has been a struggle today. Not just for me. Steve's got two, but it just they haven't been biting as much as we had hoped. But uh, this one's a little mangy look. <laughs> But he's all right. He was hungry. We'll take it. Yeah, he was hungry. He deserved a meal. New all righty, my friends. Yeah. What do we just put on there? What is that? Watermelon red. We got a watermelon red. Zoom. Uh, it's not a brush hog. It's a... Uh, brush crawl. Brush crawl. New so bait. that's the ticket right now, I guess. Definitely. All right, buddy. Thanks for the catch. Oh, yeah. There's one. Eh, not a big one, but add to our tally for the day. He's a fish. He's a fish. On a day like this, we'll take it. He was out. He was out of weight. Okay. That's about the same. Maybe a little bigger than that last one I caught, or about the same size. Yep. It has been a struggle, my friends. That's, uh, what, fish number four total? Yep. Yeah. We've been out here for about three and a half hours, so. <laughs> it's been tough. It has been, but we'll take it. There's one. There's one, Steve. There we go. All right. All right. Well, maybe they're get, starting hey, to get uh, back fired back. up. That was back to back. That was. was almost a double. Woo. Come on, buddy. Let me have it. All right. Well, we're catching fish, my friends. We're catching fish. That's all that's all that matters. Thanks for the catch, buddy. Good job. All right. All right, my friends, that's gonna do it for this episode. Really appreciate y'all tuning in. If you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe before you leave. My friends, it was a tough day. We had some challenging conditions out there post cold front and uh, windier than was forecast. And so, you know, they made us work for it today. But I will consider this a successful trip because A, I learned how to throw a bait caster and B, I caught my first bass on a bait caster. So big shout out to Steve for um, showing me the ropes. It's easy to learn fishing techniques when you got a good teacher. So we didn't light the world on fire, 
but I'm happy with what we got. Five fish and Steve got that really nice four pounder. So not gonna complain about that. Let me know if y'all enjoy these bass fishing videos. I get to do this every once in a while and I really have a good time doing it. So we'll see you next time on the Space Coast Fishing Experience. Cheers, y'all.